Hey guys, Eli here, and my time has come. <laughs> oh, what happened down here? Oh, uh, I guess it's time for me to give you a little bit of a room tour. Let's go. So yeah guys, this is my room, also known as Eli's Closet, it's really messy, and I probably should clean it, but I don't really care. Oh, and here's the little corner where me and Stefan sleep, it's really crammed, yeah, haha. <laughs> Oh yeah, and, and this is my favorite action figure. He's a bit tangled up. Now he's gone forever, and what was that? Well, sorry to interrupt the vlog, guys, but there's this weird hobo guy that wants to come into my house. I'll do the right thing and let him in. Okay. Thanks for letting me come in. Um, I have an important message for Clark. <gasps> I am Clark. Okay, well then, you're a wizard, Clark. I'm a what? Okay, let me put it this way. Has anything weird ever happened to you? Weird stuff that you couldn't explain? Well, one time I burped, sneezed, and farted at the same time. So I guess that counts as something weird. Well, you have been invited to Pink Freckles School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Yes, it is a weird name, and it's totally not a knockoff of Hogwarts. Anyway, there is a list. The first thing on the list. Do you have a pet? Hmm, well, I do have Stefan. Is that like a naked mole rat? Oh well, I'll let it count. Okay, um, do you have a wand? Well, I don't have a wand, but I do have a stick I found at the park once. Okay, I've been going easy on you, but a stick at the park does not count as a wand. We're gonna have to get you a wand at Diagon Alley. Fine. Let's go. Okay, we are now in Diagon Alley. Did we just teleport? No, it's called Apparition. Oh, okay, I don't really care. Wait, where are we getting our wands from? Well, Ollivanders, the finest place to get wands ever. But I'm broke. How are we gonna even buy the wands? Well, Clark, we're not gonna buy the wands. We're just gonna shoplift them. Run. <gasps> okay. Oh, I think I lost them, but I got my very own space sword. Zero, zero, zero. Very good, Clark. I can sense you becoming a great young wizard. Now, try out a few spells. Okay. Hocus Pocus. Abracadabra. Avaticadabra. Oh no, you have killed me, Clark. Oh. Clark, you just killed your pet. That's magical! <laughs> okay, Clark, now that you got your wand and such, you're pretty much ready to attend pig freckles. So go ask your friends if they're wizards or something, and once you find your wizarding friends, you can just like bring them back to the back porch and we'll head out. Okay, mister. I'll go and find them. Yay! Hey, Jerry. You're pretty nerdy. Are you like a wizard or something? Well, I guess you could call me a math magician. I don't care about your stupid puns. Come on, just come to the back porch and we're gonna go to Pig Freckles. Yeah, Clark? Hey, Crunky. Are you a wizard? A what? Well, let me put it like this. Has anything ever weird happened that you couldn't explain? Yeah? Well, great! Meet me outside on the back porch, and we are gonna go to Pig Freckles School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Woo! Okay, be out in a minute. Oh, poor kid. He probably doesn't have any friends, much less friends that are wizards. Hey, mister! Good news! All two of my friends have magical powers! Oh, what? Okay, um, let's go. Wait, Clark, I think I've seen the movie for this. Are we gonna get a ride the Hogwarts Express? Um, yeah, mister. Are we gonna get a ride Thomas the Choo Choo Train? We can't ride train. We don't have that kind of budget. And besides, we're gonna be late soon anyway. We're just gonna apparate. 
Oh, cool apparition. I didn't think we learned that till the sixth year. Whoa, whoa. We are now in pig freckles. Um, uh, mister, when will we be divided into our houses? Well, let's go into the great hall over there, and by the end of the night, you'll know which house you're in. Okay, guys. Onward! I miss my pig. And then I was like, chia, and then he was like, chia. <coughs> That's funny, Crunky. Guys, be quiet. I think we might be soaring to our houses soon. Quiet in the great hall. Quiet in the great hall. Quiet in the great hall! Okay, very good. I am your headmaster, Donkey, and I would like to welcome everyone back to another year at Pig Freckles. My name's Auntie. Oh, right. I forgot about the first years. Now, as a yearly tradition, we have the first years visit the sorting hat to sort them into their houses. So, um, the sorting hat is going to sing a song about all the houses. Hey, let's go. Hit it, Jerry. I am the sorting hat, as you can plainly see, and I will sort you into houses as I please. Gryffindor is the house of the brave. Ravenclaw is the house of the geeks. Um, Slytherin is for proud and arrogant souls. And Hufflepuff is for kids who don't fit in. Good job, Sorting Hat. Now, may all the first years line up to be sorted into their houses. Which really, they don't matter, because we all share the same table and the same dorm. I've taken plenty of online quizzes, but this sets the record straight of what house I'm in. Okay, do your thing, Magic Cap. Hmm, <clears throat> Jerry, let's see. Um, a intelligent person. That doesn't make any sense. Very geeky. I will use my Super Mario wing cap to make me fly. Wait, if you're geeky, that means you're in Ravenclaw. <laughs> Yay! Finally, someone acknowledges my intelligence. Hooray! Oh, heck yeah. I hope I get the most awesome house. Okay, time to put the hat on. This is really awkward. Hmm, crunky. Let's see. You are, um, very arrogant. <laughs> He'll never find me. A bit of a bully at some times. Nobody loves you. That's it. Slytherin. <laughs> Yay! It is my turn next. Hello, everybody. I am Neville Longbottom. I am walking with a stick up my butt because um, I have a long bottom. Now, um, I am late because my grandma made a wrong turn. Oh, are we doing the sorting hat ceremony? I gotta get, get my hat sorted. Ah, oh, time to sit my long bottom down on the stool. This is uncomfortable. Okay, time to sort myself. Hey, you really don't belong in anything. I'm pretty sure you're not even a wizard. But anyway, I guess we'll just do eeny, meeny, miny, mo. E <laughs> you're really not Gryffindor, but I guess still, since it, it eeny, meeny, miny, mo chose Gryffindor. Um, uh, Yay! That means that I am brave. I am so excited. Woo! And that kid's almost as stupid as me. Well, time to find out what house I'm in. Yay! This is the moment of truth. Okay, Sorting Hat, do your thing. Oh, Clark, an adventurous spirit. Whoa, I'm already there. You love to explore. Oh, look at that lake. You are very brave and stand up for what's right. I guess that means that you are a great... What? I don't want Gryffindor. There's, see, there's no way in a Hufflepuff yet. I want to be in a Hufflepuff. That's not why I have unicorn, like puffy unicorn. Well, golly, Clark. I guess if you really want to, Hufflepuff. <laughs> Yay, I'm in Hufflepuff. Hooray. My name is Dante. Yes, yes, welcome all first years. Now, after you are done eating, you can go back to your dorms, which you share with all the other houses. 
Now, um, disperse. <laughs> Guys, just behind this door is the room that we're going to be staying in for the rest of the school year. Maybe we will all have queen-size beds. Oh boy, I can't handle the anticipation. Clark, open the door. Okay. Wow, it's even better than I expected. We all get to share a bed. Uh, Clark always wets the bed, so hopefully he doesn't sleep in the middle. I call sleeping in the middle. Good night. I am uncomfortable. Good morning, everybody. Ah! Oh, it's just you, Clark. Um, yup, that's right, it's morning time! Ah, Clark, you woke us up an hour early, cause you know there was a time change. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot we operated here. Yeah, well anyways, I guess that we should just head to our first class. Our first class is, um, Quidditch class, which should be right out back. Hello everybody, I am Professor Teacher, and this is my Quidditch class. Hey, my name is Neville Longbottom. Nobody cares about you, Neville. Anyways, as it is the first day of class, we shall go over some fire safety. Now, if there is a fire drill, you just stand and watch as kids frantically run out of school. Ha 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 ha. Man, Clark, this class is whack. Yeah, totally, man. I'm gonna kill climb a tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh shoot. Hey, wait, I know how to fly a broom because I saw the movies once. What do you do? Um, um, up. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, oh no, my bottom fell out. Oh no, Neville, are you okay? Ha, uh, just kidding. I don't care about you. Our next class is potions. Ugh. I don't want to go to another class. Man, school is whack. Oh, come on, guys. Potions is pretty cool. I mean, like, you can make a love potion for Sally. Wait, what? Don't listen to him, Clark. Come on, let's go to the bathroom and ditch class together. Uh, okay. You know what? Fine, I'll just go to potions without you and be a good, educated wizard. Bye. Uh, I'm so glad we ditched class, Clark. School is so lame. Yeah, I know, Crunky. <gasps> the Frog Puppet Friend has returned. Oh, hey, guys. Welcome to the wizarding world. Have you tried butterbeer yet? No. Well, it's really good. Here, I'm going to get you a scoop. Here, try it. Oh, okay. That is some good butterbeer. Ah, this is gonna be the best school year ever! It's the last day of school. This was a great year. We learned a lot about our magical powers. Yeah, and um... Whose phone is ringing? Oh, that's just my crappy LG phone. I didn't know they had service here. Well, let me answer it. Hello? Meet me in the Chamber of Secrets. Uh, okay. Only you shall come. Don't bring your friends. Aw, can I bring Crunky and Jerry? I said, don't bring your friends. Aw, well, okay, gotta go. Okay, guys, I am going into the Chamber of Secrets on a solo mission, and you guys are not allowed to come. Bye! Yes! Ma ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Oh man, the Chamber of Secrets must be really secret, cause like, I don't see any signs pointing to where it is. I'm completely lost. Clark, get your butt in here. 
Oh, it must be in there. Let's go! Oh, hello, sir. Don't call me sir. Call me the Dark Lord! <laughs> so, do you think Clark's okay? Yeah, he's probably fine. Yes, I am the Dark Lord who killed your parents and tried to kill you, but you somehow survived, and I somehow died, and I'm somehow still alive, and I brought you to Pig Freckles so I could get you to go through the full school year, and at the very end, we'd have the ultimate showdown in a wizard battle. Let's go! Abadakadabra. <laughs> Yay, I won! Congratulations, Clark, on defeating the Dark Lord. We are all pleased. Ow, oh, thank you, Donkey. And Clark, do you know what saved you from the Dark Lord on that night that your parents died? Why? Your mother's love. Aww. No, just kidding. He was about to kill you, and then he slipped and hit his head and suffered a concussion. Oh, ha, <laughs> noob. <laughs> Oh, I don't feel so good. Uh... Oh, hey, Stefan. Ew, at least you're alive. Oh, everything was just a dream. Or was it? 